see lots of questions on Facebook around who's the best agent to sell my house. And I'm always mm, wondering about how people make sense of the answers because everybody's going to have a view based on their personal experience. And, and often the answers might be 10, 15 or 20 agents and this person's the best and this person's the best and this person's the best. So here's a few tips for sellers wanting to um, yeah, maneuver through that sort of um, that, that uh, maze, if you like. So number one tip, talk to more than one agent. I say three is the magic number. I actually physically get them into your property and sit down and have what I call a belly to belly conversation. You know, it, it's like, do I trust this person to be my advocate? Do I, am, am I going to put this process in the hands of another person who's going to act in my best interests? Really ask that question and, and what's the communication going to be like and what am I going to expect of this person and what are they going to be able to deliver? Uh, one thing that I would say absolutely categorically, do not base your decision on the price that they give you. Because right now, it's a very difficult minefield. You know, there's different levels of pricing. That's a whole other story. But uh, more about the process that the agent's going to engage in, in terms of maximising that price. Probably one of the things that I'd be looking for with my knowledge is to find the agent who really understands emotion, uh, almost the psychologist amongst them, the person who knows how to uh, negotiate and the dialogue, the how to get inside the minds of the buyers and, and create a competitive but fair process that is going to have you know, uh, a really great outcome, um, but one that you all feel comfortable with at the end. So just get the three agents, start asking the questions. Good luck.